Hello everyone, this is the Innovation Project. We are the robotic nerds from Pacoima Charger Elementary School. This year we want to tell everyone that we need to explore the ocean more. We have explored 15.2 billion miles of space but only 7 miles of the ocean. This is why we are building a submarine. We would want to explore more of the ocean to discover new sea life. We are still learning about fishes that have been around us for hundreds of years but researching them is difficult because they live really deep in the ocean. Our mission is to create a submarine that will go to the depths of seven miles or more. We didn't choose the HOV, which stands for Human Occupied Vehicle, because we had to be in the submarine and we didn't want to risk our life. The ROV, which stands for Remotely Operated Vehicle, was also wasn't an option because it's tethered and it would limit our explorations of the deep sea. This year we are doing a competition called the First Lego League. The theme is submerged. We built a robot that would do the missions. By completing it, each mission, we would get points. I did a submarine called an AUV that would help us explore more deeper in the ocean. The difficulties that we have is the pressure, the coldness, and the darkness. So I added LED lights, storage so we could keep samples, a radar sensor, a pressure sensor, and the camera. The message that we're trying to spread is that we only know about 5% of the ocean and 95% is unexplored. We have been researching about new sea life and sea creatures. I will give you an example of a sea creature, a sea angel. It was discovered in 1676. It's a type of swimming snail. The muscular foot found in land snails has evolved into a pair of wings like structures called parapodia. The barrel eye fish looks weird. The head is like see through, and you might think like the eyes in front are the actual eyes, but they're not. They're the nostrils. They could live up to 60 years, and their eyes are also like inside their head so they can look up and also like straight anytime they want. Another fish is the red hand fish. This fish was discovered in 1844. This fish lives in the depths between 2 to 20 meters. There are only about a hundred left in the wild. A threat to this fish is habitat loss and destruction from native sea urchins. The regular hand fish went extinct because of habitat loss and destructive fishing practices. One of the deep sea fishes that we know is called the Dumbo octopus. It got its name because it looks like the, the elephant Dumbo. It has what looks like ears but is actually wing. It works like wings to help it swim through the ocean. I researched about a fish called the black dragonfish. Its teeth are made out of nanocrystal. They only see red. They have a bioluminescence light that they can only see but nobody else can see. The goblin shark has the fastest jaws in the ocean. It has to be slowed down to see it better if you want to see it catch its prey. Their jaws move 10 feet per second. They're sluggish when swimming but they're real fast when they attack.